hello everybody today i'm going to show you how to make the best homemade pizza that completely can be customized you can add any topic wedge or non veg for non veg you can add chicken tikka and top up with thick layer of mozzarella cheese like this and let's check out the ingredients for pizza base in a large bowl add yeast and sugar and add warm water do not add any uh, do not add hot water because it will kill the yeast now mix gently mixture must be turned frothy and bubbly add flour salt mix And add a little water at a time add warm water a little water at a time and form a smooth and soft dough like this and massage for five minutes drizzle oil and massage a bit and you can divide into four piece or two according to the size of the base that you like and shape it to a form a ball like this cover the uh, with the wet towel or with the lid at a room temperature until the dough rises double in size now let's check out the pizza base sauce. I always store and keep this chili flakes and oregano seasoning whenever uh, I make uh, Italian dishes I just add them. Um, fire roast tomatoes, garlic and white onion the perfect uh, for making homemade pasta sauce and salsa. Uh, to a tomato should be firm uh, and not soft so keep close eye on the grill at all time so after you grill the tomatoes you cut into pieces and add to the chopper garlic white onion and tomato all the grilled stuff and tomato paste and uh, chop them till you get nice pulpy consistency Heat oil in a dish and transfer this uh, pizza based sauce, chili flakes, oregano, and this is smoked house uh, seasoning. If you don't, this is uh, optional. Salt and lime juice, and give it a stir and cook for five to six minutes. It's already smelling so good. Roasted garlic and onion and tomato flavor. I'm going to add paprika. Mix. And a little tomato ketchup to give that uh, a hint of sweetness to the sauce. And switch off the flame. And allow it to cool this delicious smoky flavor pizza base sauce is ready if you want to avoid all this trouble you can always go ahead and use ready-made pizza base sauce and for pizza topping I'm using zucchini tomato mushroom and uh, baby corn and capsicum you can go ahead and add uh, sausage slices also for non veg and here i have uh, olives and jalapeno chili topical now the dough doubled in size so dust the space uh, with a little flour dry flour and shape them a round circle with the rolling pin or with your hands and uh, use a fork to prick the base uh, with it so that the base doesn't rise and uh, it gets baked nicely while baking this is perfect 
let's bake the uh, pizza base first and put it into the preheat oven and bake it for 10 minutes this oven is already set for pizza after 10 minutes your pizza base is ready it's nice and soft look at that Just keep all the layering ready like pizza sauce and the toppings And add the pizza homemade sauce um, apply sauce all over the pizza add toppings like tomatoes and uh, you can add I'm adding mushroom and zucchini baby corn uh, olives and um, jalapeno and you can add uh, chicken sausage slices if you're a non-vegetarian chicken tikka any topics you like you can add broccoli and uh, add uh, top it up with thick layer of mozzarella cheese and sprinkle oregano uh, herbs put this pizza in a baking tray and place it inside the oven and cook for 10 minutes until the crust is golden and cheese melted delicious homemade pizza is ready sprinkle chili flakes and enjoy and I'm going to repeat two more pizza with the same pizza base and the stuffing. I hope you like this recipe guys and uh, love you and God bless you. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Ciao.